Like and subscribe right now, or you're gonna have terrible luck for the next week. From kaijus worthy of a match with Godzilla himself, to the largest bony fish in the world, here are 10 giant creatures caught on camera. Number 10. Monstrous Kaiju Kaijus are giant monsters prominently featured in Japanese fantasy and science fiction movies, TV programs, and of course, anime. So why are the mighty kaiju starting off this list? Has a real one been caught on camera? Well, not quite real, but extremely convincing fakes. Also, the creator of the videos isn't passing them off as real monster footage, but rather as samples of the great visual effects that he does. The channel's name is Hollywood Scotty and it's full of realistic kaiju videos. If you're a big fan of these mountain-sized monsters, I suggest go check him out. Number 9. The Giant Pacific Octopus Compared to the giant squid and the colossal squid, the Pacific giant octopus doesn't get as much love. Well, it should. It is an amazing animal and is so rare that most of what scientists know about them comes from a few corpses that wash ashore. Footage of them out in the wild are also quite rare, making this particularly large specimen filmed in the inland waters of Washington state quite amazing. The giant Pacific octopus grows bigger and lives longer than any other octopus species. The size record is held by a specimen that was 30 feet across and weighed more than 600 pounds. Averages are more like 16 feet and 110 pounds. Number 8. The Lion's Mane Jellyfish From one giant skeletonless creature to another one, but this time noticeably bigger. The lion's mane jellyfish is the world's largest jellyfish. Their bells can be over 8 feet across. These jellies have a mass of thin tentacles that resemble a lion's mane, which is where their name originates. Reports of tentacle size in lion's mane jellyfish vary from 30 feet up to 120 feet. Either way, their tentacles extend a long way and one should give them a very wide berth. This jellyfish also has lots of tentacles. It has 8 groups of them with 70 to 150 tentacles in each group. These giant jellies are not only large but also very dangerous. These guys sting and they sting hard. Not enough to be fatal though, but a sting from one of these creatures is excruciatingly painful, which is probably the reason why there aren't a lot of footage of this creature floating around. Number 7. The Jacksonville Dinosaur this video looks like it's that of a reporter covering some story in downtown Jacksonville. Some sound must have startled them because they suddenly panned the camera to look over the fence into what looks like a construction site when they saw the giant reptile. The camera was so shaky we can't really see if the thing was moving. So did they really capture a giant dinosaur in Jacksonville? Number 6. The Blob of Acapulco Back in March of 2016, a 30-foot unidentified blob from the sea washed up on the beach in Acapulco, Mexico. Some scientists believe the creature to be a whale and others a squid. And of course, people on the internet think it's a terrifying monster. Whatever it is, the creature appears to have died shortly before beachgoers discovered it. Though it was not fully decomposed, it was well on its way. This isn't the only strange blob-like sea monster that has been seen though. Many have washed onto beaches all over the world. While some of them can easily be identified, some, like the Blob of Acapulco, remain a mystery to this day. Number 5. The Giant Oarfish The giant oarfish has always been mistaken for a sea monster, and just by looking at one, you'll definitely understand the reason why. They are absolutely ginormous fish, having been known to reach lengths of up to 110 feet long. It has long been thought that the old stories about sea serpents came about by encounters with this fish. Oarfish are typically found at depths of about 656 feet but can go as deep as about 3,280 feet. While biologists don't know why the giant fish come to shore, they suspect either they are washed towards beaches by storms or they come to the surface when they are injured or dying. That's why this footage is kind of surprising. It shows a giant oarfish in shallow waters near the shore. 
but instead of looking sickly or dying, it looks quite energetic. In Japan, this species is traditionally known as Ryugu no Chukai or as Jinja Him and is believed to be the servant or messenger of the Dragon King, ruler of the sea. Number 4. The Giant Oceanic Manta Ray Ever wonder how it's like to fly beside a small airplane? Well, take a trip to Mexico and swim beside one of these giants. I guarantee you'll feel the same exact sensation. The giant manta ray is the largest ray and one of the largest fish in the world. Reaching widths of up to 29 feet, the manta rays are much larger than any other ray species. Despite their very large size, they are filter feeders, gorging themselves on tiny plankton. They constantly swim along with their large mouths open, filtering plankton and other small food from the water. To aid in this strategy, giant mantas have specialized flaps known as cephalic lobes, which help direct more water and food into their mouths. Giant manta rays are found worldwide in tropical, subtropical, and temperate waters and are commonly seen offshore in oceanic waters and near productive coastlines. They also migrate periodically between warm and cold waters, which is actually the best time to catch them on camera. Number 3 the giant squid. Surely, you didn't think that a list about giant animals would be complete without this guy, did you? The giant squid is the largest invertebrate in the world, but despite that, we know next to nothing about it. The largest of these elusive giants ever found measured 59 feet in length and weighed nearly a ton. We know so little about these giant creatures because they prefer non-contact with humans, perfectly content in staying in the deep ocean where they are known to reside. They do, however, venture into shallower waters every now and then, which might be the basis of ancient sailors' tales about the Kraken. But almost everything scientists know about them is from the carcasses that have washed up on beaches or been hauled in by fishermen. Like other squid species, they have eight arms and two longer feeding tentacles that help them bring food to their beak-like mouths. Their diet likely consists of fish, shrimp, and other squid, and some suggest they might even attack and eat small whales. What you are seeing is rare footage of the giant squid, here making a surprise appearance in Toyama Bay in Japan. Now it's time for today's best pick. Today's best pick is a scary encounter between a diver and one of the largest snake species in the world. Find out more next. Number 2 The Green Anaconda a member of the boa family, South America's green anaconda is, pound for pound, the largest snake in the world. Green anacondas can grow to more than 29 feet, weigh more than 550 pounds, and measure more than 12 inches in diameter. This one in the photo is a bit smaller at 26 feet, but it's certainly no less terrifying. Which is why the bravery of this diver is so impressive. The photos were captured by diver, photographer, snake enthusiast, and probably the bravest man in the world, 53-year-old Frankel Banfi. He joined the massive animal in its natural habitat armed only with his camera. Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that'll take 5 seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell, and you will get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it, it really works. Number 1. The Ocean Sunfish the ocean sunfish holds the world record for being the largest bony fish species in the world, and that is despite it having no true tail. The biggest one ever recorded grew to over 4 meters from fin to fin and weighed an astounding 2.7 tons. This one you see in this rare footage is a smaller specimen, but it still looks large when side by side with the submersible. In various parts of the world, ocean sunfish have gained mythical status and quite a few legends have been attributed to this ugly fish. Polynesians, such as the indigenous people of Hawaii, believe that killing slender sunfish is bad luck. They believe that sunfish are makua, the king of the mackerel, and that by killing a sunfish, mackerel will not find their way to the fishing grounds that the Polynesians depend on. In 1600s Japan, the shogun would accept a sunfish in lieu of taxes. In modern Japan, sunfish are beloved and 
swimming with the mola, as sunfish are otherwise called, is a popular pastime. The sunfish Pokemon Alomomola is even heart-shaped as a sign of the love that Japan has for them. Which of these gigantic animals impressed you the most? Let us know down below in the comments. Also make sure to hit subscribe as well as the notification bell. That way, you'll get notified every time we upload new and amazing content just like this. Again, thanks for watching and see you on the next video.